This is Late Night with Drake here. We are on Drake Running TV, kicking ass, taking names, and making a lot of friends. And if you want to block me, it's cool. I know, you, I know you're going to love me in the end. All right, we're playing a game called Hot or Not. And I don't care. We're just going to play it. We're going to roll with it. Somebody told me we, sh we should not do this game. And I was like, well, what should we do? She said you should play Cool or Not, but I can't do that. I just can't. I'm going to go raw and be real on the mic. I just can't. There was like natural. Oh, you can't. You gotta be real. Okay, so hot or not, this is how it goes. I talk about hot or not, my claws, but you on the other side can say, you know, hot, not, your claws. It's all on your own mindset. So here's some hot girls. First off, Italian Prime Minister. Oh, she's hot. I'm gonna give a big hot. I don't know about you. Cindy, she graduated from law school in Salerno, Italy, and there's no one that's gonna object to the way that she looks. <laughs> She's participated for the Miss Italy contest in 1997 oh, yeah. and finished in sixth place. Makes me want to go to Italy. The feel of the competitions made her feel like a woman hey, and matured her, and she understood who she was. Maybe there is some similarity to beauty competitions and politics. She's been seen on television as a showgirl with some skilled dance moves and on Maxim magazine where she bared it all. She has been a little bit of political stances and has won to crack down on prostitution throughout Italy. In 2008, she was accused of a little dirty talk with the Prime Minister of Italia. Number 13, Princess Beatrice. Oh yeah. This is the daughter I of love a princess. <laughs> and she's not looking too shabby if you're trying to become royalty sometime in the future. I love she's running her hair. Hi, I'm great. To nice to meet you. Road, so that's definitely got to score some attraction points. 29 years old and a net worth of 29. This could work. Making this princess your queen could mean some serious cash in the bank. She loves fashion and can be seen wearing some pre fashion hats is fashion. <laughs> market for a man, by the way. <laughs> I think she got overthrown recently, but uh, whatever, I may be wrong. Many were surprised that she was able to marry into the royal Spanish family, but she didn't. She married the prince of Asturias, and then moved into the palace not too long that after. That was a chick, but I want to marry the prince of Wales. Queen, you got a little bit of competition Total sure. hot! She married the prince of Asturias at the time. No, I'm going to change, change it, it's a knot. Since 2014, I don't know, Felipe not. Is now the she doesn't really Spain. know. Don't get caught checking her out while he's around. I'm good, nah, uh, it's a knot. Number we'll 11, Ina Rabani Kar. Our next attractive politician comes from the country of Pakistan, and she's the 26th foreign minister of the Middle Eastern country. Kar is a part of a Not very powerful feudal family no. in the city of Bhutan. You out there can say Pakistan. yes, but I know you're lying her to your moral standards. Her studying facial features and natural good looks has gained her popularity. There's just something exotic about her, since females don't typically gain power in politics in this part yeah, of the world. Yeah, I'm saying not. Yeah. She has a good sense of fashion and is primarily seen wearing a veil, giving her a sense of mystery. You won't find any revealing photos of her, because she just doesn't seem like that kind of girl. Sorry guys though, this one is taken. Car is married and has two daughters. Number 10, Ruby Dalla. This smoking Canadian politician woman is a, a total of hot of Drake Rudyard TV standard. From a family who was from Punjab, India, and she's had close ties with her family's country. She's been politically active from a young age and is a prominent member of the Liberal Party. She's the first female Sikh member of the Canadian Parliament, and she was the star of her own Bollywood film. Young yeah, I'll go with that. She's a hot. I can see her breaking the lamp in the middle of the night and saying, Bollywood. get out in the morning. That's cool with me. It might be seen ice skating in wintertime, or making a run to Tim Hortons. She'll never shy away from her Indian roots, Tim and can Hortons. do some very interesting, yet risque dance moves if you look up her Bollywood film. Damn! Number nine, Alina Kabeba. It might be freezing cold over in Russia right now, but the women are smoking hot. Her yes, they Kaiba are smoking hot. Oh my God! And is a gymnast. But it's funny because all the like the ugly ones are here, and you don't know that yet, America. The hot ones are over there. And when you get over there, they're way hotter. Go to the city. Hot trot. Oh, by the way, we should probably 
probably mention that the same party led by Pete Dooney, even as she enters her mid-30s, many have noticed that she's keeping in tip-top physical shape. During her performances as a gymnast, she can be seen displaying graceful flexibility and showing off the beautiful smile to go with it. She won gold for her skills, but is mostly known for getting involved with Putin's affairs. Her good looks got her the front page of Vogue Russia as well. Ooh. Number 8, Sarah Palin. Alright, yeah, I like some Jennifer Sarah Palin. That's a hot and Drake that book. Sarah Palin's looks are bangin'. Yeah, bangin'. 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 Okay with some older women and bangin'. scared off by the... Bangin'. And it looks... The fact that she's a supporter worry, of the Second Amendment, she you know. might be your type. Yeah, she's yeah. also got herself mm. a pretty sweet rap sheet as well. She can call herself the ninth governor of Alaska, and don't forget, she ran for vice president with John McCain. Thanks. She's got the ability to write a oh. book, too, and wrote the book Going Rogue, which has sold more than two million copies. After graduation, she worked Believe it or not, it's true. She made more money on the book than she did in the election. And she married her high school sweetheart, Todd Palin. For the age of 53, you gotta admit, there could be worse oh, options yeah. out there, mm. right? She didn't get films saying the most intelligent things ever, but there's just something about her that people seem to be attracted to, in a way. Yeah, fake beat. Three. Number seven, Damn. Anna Maria Gulligan. Don't worry, we didn't forget about you, Anna. If you're didn't watching this, you're saying, American Eye has please. his eye on you. She's been deemed as one of the most popular politicians and public figures. She's from the small Baltic nation of Estonia and has a history of being a lawyer in the You can often find her in the center Sarah. of the Estonian Reform True. Party. After being convicted of embezzling 60,000 euros from the nonprofit organization where she was the CEO, she fled to London and describes herself as a refugee. She's one of the hottest girls in politics and showed her true self when she posed for Estonian Playboy in 2009. She did a little bit of time in prison in Tallinn for being a bad prison. girl. Prison! She's hot in my book. <laughs> She ran for parliament, but failed to get enough votes. Too bad. Better I would have gave her all the votes in the world if I was in parliament. Number six, Yuri Fujikawa. Some believe she's too beautiful to be in politics. Others I don't know. I don't got a thing for Asians. In the world. For me and Drake, make sure the camera's straight. Me and Drake, get on me. Yeah, me and Drake, we don't get along with she Asians. She was just a councilwoman for a small city on the yeah. eastern part of the prefecture, and then photos started to emerge. Photos of Yuri leaving a hotel room with a married politician caused a scandal to break loose, which only made her more famous. Her image went viral for all the wrong reasons. Seeing a perfect moment to make I don't know, that's a big nod. She ain't getting a hot in my book. Soft core films. Her popularity has skyrocketed, and reimagine it's not from her strategic policies. She is extremely photogenic, to say the least, and just about every photo taken of her seems to show natural beauty without her even trying. Uh. Number five, Nicole Minetti. A dental hygienist by the name of Nicole Minetti I would do it. got herself She's into hot. politics by possibly seducing the Italian Prime Minister, Silvio Berlusconi. Her official title became a regional cap. Alright. That was a little bit of hot or not. I just want to take a little gander at some girls. We got some music coming for you guys. On me. And it's going to be pretty dope. So I can't wait. This is Drake running to be late night with Drake. We're coming your way right now. Oh yes, it's true. And it's nice to see you. Tune in.